Welcome back dear followers, please subscribe my channel for daily weather and cyclone forecast for this region, thank you. Tropical depression TD06F in 998 HPA was located near 14.8 south 168.1 west or about 630 kilometers northwest of Palmerston Island or about 990 kilometers west northwest of Itutaki Island. TD06F is expected to intensify into a category 1 tropical cyclone in the next 24 to 48 hours. It is expected to bring gale force winds over southern Cooks with the associated rain and thunderstorms as it approaches the group from the northwest later tomorrow. Expect fine weather apart from brief showers today. Rain and thunderstorms developing from the northwest as TD06F moves closer to the group later tomorrow, moderate to fresh southeast winds increasing 45 km per hour tomorrow, winds expected to eventually increase to 65 km per hour later tomorrow, moderate to rough seas today, rough to very rough seas with heavy swells from later tomorrow, poor visibility in areas of heavy rain and thunderstorms from later tomorrow, expected impacts from later tomorrow. Isolated damages to tree branches, some houses of light materials or unshielded structures in exposed communities, poor. Visibility for motorists in areas of heavy rain, river and flash flooding of low-lying and flood-prone areas, high risk of sea travel for all crafts, risky hazardous breaking waves and coastal inundation along low-lying coastal areas. For Australia today, a low is positioned southwest of Queensland, with a trough extending southwards into central inland New South Wales, with associated convective cloud and thunderstorms. Significant mid to upper level cloud is present around the system, streaming southwards over much of New South Wales and eastern Victoria. A cold front lies from a low southeast of Tasmania through eastern Victoria, joining with a trough over South Australia, the south of the Northern Territory, and into the Pilbara in Western Australia. An upper level disturbance is generating mid to upper level cloud over coastal South Australia and Victoria. Onshore flow is producing low level cloud. Along the south coast of Western Australia, southwestern South Australia, northeastern New South Wales and parts of the Queensland coastline.